One particular skill that teachers often send me photos or videos of saying, surely this is not good, is a needle or a scorpion pose where the leg is taken up behind, either bringing the foot to the head or in some cases bringing the back of the head to the back of the thigh. Now, often the representations of these that I'm sent aren't great at all. There's often a lot of hinging in the low back. There may be shifting forward of the femoral head in the socket. So we want to keep an eye out for any of the things that we've already been looking at. However, in some disciplines, this is something that is required. So I want to show a way of carefully assessing their capability for going into it using something called dancer's pose, which again is a more yogic style version, where we can look at all of the elements in a little bit of a safer way. If they can't do a dancer's pose well, there is no way we're going to be able to do a full needle or scorpion. And I'd far rather you work on assessing it there and developing those elements before we go anywhere near bringing our foot to our head.